Hello. Would you two be interested in a bit of iron? Come in and talk. It's not as headachey. Right. All right. Good to see you both. <clears throat> I'll make this rather quick. I've got a lot going on. Um, the the baker wants to make a trip to the um, outpost, and they sell iron there. Small things, nails, rivets, and the such. Um, but we could get you some small miscellaneous bits of iron. Theoretically, we could get you as many as four of them. <coughs> Is that something you'd That's be interested in? Better than zero. Good news. I mean... I have a deadline tomorrow for that Capitano, and I have no way to finish his order without iron. It's... there's a catch. It's rather expensive because it's the courier's outpost. Um... How much? Would... Well, at cost alone, it's a silver 50 apiece. <laughs> but... Jeez. Yes, it's rather steep. How much silver do we have in the forge itself? I've got about three in my pocket. In the forge itself, we have eight. <sighs> Fuck. I did also hear something that might be useful to you, um, or mm. not, or concerning. The merchants that came into town, or rather the, um, the ship captain that came into town, has a shipment of iron for some mystery buyer. Um, you didn't hear that from me. They wouldn't tell me. That's I learned it from a friend who did what I was going to tell you. Wait, oh. which merchant? The one with the heavy cart. She wouldn't say. But, um... It's the, the ones that own the boat. Still in the port. Yes, and it's from the ones that, um... They have the ship part outside of that starving town. They're the Sawtooth Shipping Company. They're quite big in the area, last I heard. Apparently, the cart that they have there is Wait, filled no. to the brim with iron ore. Though, when I went to try and purchase it from them, they told me that there was nothing in there except for food, which obviously counted as bullshit. Cerevith was the one to... Uh, Whoa. sneak a peek into it and she told me about it she's going to try and diplomatically try and get us some ore into the forge as well I told her no stealing or roguery or fuckery like that because that would look bad on us she says she has an angle she can work so holding out for that maybe mm -hmm. but the fact that they lied is a little well, that aside I mean this is reminiscent of the conversations yesterday and what you were talking to a mem about Yes. A cart full of wagon... Uh, I'm sorry, a cart full of iron coming out of nowhere? Passing through Nautis oh. itself? Oh. I didn't even stop to consider that. Uh, where the fuck did the iron come from? It certainly didn't come from Nautis. I just that figured they were merchants from the Freeport. And they said they were the Sawtooth? They told, introduced themselves as the Vermilion something or another to me. No, there's... Pretty sure they're Sawtooth. They all have the same emblem. This ship might be called the Vermilion. Hmm. Ah, okay. They... Well, regardless, um, the caravan is leaving now, uh, so do you, do you want me to make the purchase? I don't have a choice. Uh, tell me how much you need, and I'll give you the silver. I don't know how much Markle's going to want, but um, we can get you four pieces. It would be, at, at the cost, it would be six silvers, and then if you could throw in, I don't know, an extra, just five coppers on top of that per piece. So six silvers, 20 coppers. God. God. We're, com we're coming out in the negatives after this. Yeah. Past the negatives. Between that fucking captain and the, the kind of coin that these merchants ask for. Well, the good news is I might be able to charter these people. But, but That's correct, right, chat? One, one nine five. Um, which they might be. These people or some other people, I might be able to get you as much as 40 to... Or 20 to 30 units of iron ore. 
perhaps. All things go well. That's the silver needed plus five copper per iron piece. Right. I'll see you back whenever it's done. I hope that we don't have any sort of issues after this, but until I get paid by that captain, if he pays, I've got nothing. So I'm taking a gamble here. Mm. We have less than two silver in the forge funds now. Yes, I know. I know. We'll make it work. Uh, just a new version. I don't All have right. a choice. I'll be back then. Make sure you're not, let me make sure you're not gone too time. long in case anyone comes around looking for you for what you told me about. Right. I'll make it quick. Hmm. <sighs> and that's when he leaves town with our silver and there was He no never comes back. Iron. Fucking... <laughs> never trust him. Yeah, now we're not looking well, too hot. Hopefully it works. <coughs> is this to get small iron miscellaneous, or is this to get four bits of iron? Probably miscellaneous. That's... Not great at all by any means. Really bad. But I'm desperate. Yeah. I know. Um... Oh, important. I heard in the marketplace... Uh... That apparently there's supposed to be a big um, motherfucker. This is what was happening People to me yesterday. People are supposed to be giving. <laughs> yeah. I know. Um, Baron Kovars is supposed to be coming down and buying drinks for everyone again. Yeah. I want you to tell him. I want you to find out what he's up to, what he talks about, who his confidants are. I want to know more about this brother who seems to not give a shit. About a mem taking control of the house and allowing himself to be called Baron. Hmm. That's the equivalent of you going around and calling yourself Lord while I was still alive. Right. You see what I'm saying? Uh, it's very strange. I can do that. It does not speak well. Good. I'll do what Silma. Save yourself, my boy. <laughs> oh, I know what he's here for, actually. Ah, yes. <laughs> what can I do for you, my you. No, wanting to chat for a little bit, as well as to check on the order. It's actually finished. Or well, an order. Ah, oh, you do work fast. <laughs> You're all paid for, aren't you? It was a scalpel and the clamps, I believe. Holy shit. The clamps and the arrow bracket, actually. That's, that's the one. that. That's what I gave. Sure. <laughs> Damn, it's great to see these in the in these in this condition again. That's before they get ready. <sighs> Thank the gods. <laughs> well, you know that. Mm. Thank you. Seriously. Oh, and before I forget. Like, like with Tazima, do you need me to call you Shariq. anything else? Shadi, Shadi. You're like the I'm first sorry, person who's pronounced it properly. I'm used to it. <laughs> Amazing. All right then, Shadi. Mm. Thank you, thank you so much for that. With this, I should be able to get a lot more coin easily. Maybe you to save lives too, hopefully. Oh yes, especially with the arena that's coming up later on in the day. It's a good thing I have this now. Hmm. Now I should be much, much more prepared than usual. But uh, either way, you two seem to be busy yourselves with quite possibly a lot of work from the gods. Yeah, we've got an order we've been balls to the wall with, so to speak. <laughs> Do tell. Yeah. I feel as if I've been balls, balls to the wall that, as of recent from the two days ago. <laughs> oh, shit. All right. I won't keep you all in for too much longer then. <sighs> Thank you. This, this should be able to help. Thank you so much for the repairs. I'll make sure to put them to good use. Carry on. Thank you.
You wouldn't happen to have the use for buying raw food, would you? <laughs> no. Try the tavern. Ah. I'm about to. I give up on trying to find a butcher in this town. The last few times I've tried, he hasn't been in. How did you do that? I spilled something on me. Five 
you want. Uh, how much? How much for just uh, just the soup? Soup would be twenty copper. Oh, yeah. You know. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you got to do the stretches. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I lose all to myself. But uh, here, yes. Just a thing of soup, Thank please. You. Of course. Uh, Miss Aubrey. Thank you. Uh, feel free to take a seat. We'll bring it out in a moment. Oh. Brilliant, brilliant. Hello, sir. My stomach, thank you. I'll have a soup no, as well, please. But of course, sir. It will be 20 copper as well. Of course. Thank you very much. Give us a few moments. <clears throat> a second of all, if you please, Miss Aubrey. Carrots. You're doing Ow. good work. Right. you are. Thank you very much. Thank you. Good to see you. Good afternoon. How's it going? This all a fancy man on a horse. I'm glad you've been in the fancy man on a horse. Looks like a mercenary. Over there, uh, Here's your soup. Yeah. Hope you enjoy. Appreciate it. Don't feel the cat in the world if he ran a person over. Oh, no. <laughs> Harry, you, you're, you've been staring at me this whole time. <laughs> I told you I could do this. You tell him to stop. I've seen you this whole time looking at me. Very <laughs> true. Sometimes I think that to be the hardest quest for me to strategy. <laughs> Get out of the aircon blast. It is fucking up the mic. Maybe something is holding I have a daughter. What is that? I'm kidding. Why do you have to say it like that? The sex. At least he at least he didn't say it like some hobbit I heard say it. He said sex was like two G's. No! That's what he was saying! It must have been a dialect or something. I don't fucking know. But mental I can be all around its tavern, so anyone can hear it. I think so. Alright, so I'm going to have to pay him. Having that for nothing, he's part of the number. Do I have to wait for my daughter to come back? And then we'll be resuming business. Just a trip on the town over. <laughs> uh, we're waiting. It will, it will. She'll be back in the morning. But anyway. Now I should beat you to the Of course, Captain. Uh, you know way. We've been around here forever. Thank you very much. Full of soup, please. You can find a way around them. Thank you very much. So, I'm kind of curious now, honestly. Do you have any idea what this is? Living in Uber's apartment. Not many things that Apparently somebody uh, threatened the I tavern have owner in any of the yes. for this. But it my guess is it true. Yeah. Waiting for the boy. I'm getting a drink. I'm just taking a break. 
That's all from the other side of the town, somewhere over there. That sounds I don't have an issue with uh, anything else you're doing. You're doing a great job. I've already got everything. Also, there is a sweet I'm still willing to pay, so I can get it. Oh Are you going to I have a set amount I can pay for, and if I start cutting into that, I'm going to have to raise my prices for meals. Could they follow? You like the you like the price that yeah, they are at now? Excuse me. I have to say. Don't want to run anyone over. <laughs> 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 Well, if he's ever not in, I'm still waiting to pay. You know, probably not the first place. I do see someone at there at the moment, just so you know. Thank you. Uh, right. Ah, my dear. I see you again. <laughs> I'm just here for some water for now. Oh. It's a hot day. <laughs> How much is that again? Is it 50? A tin copper for one of these. Okay. Are you doing oh, yeah. Have you got the Fialda yet? Yes. About the, uh, the sickle? Thank you so much. You That's mean the, the club in the form of a sword? Yes, I've already paid him for it. He'll probably, he's probably out getting wood for it as we speak. Well, here's what you do. You think uh, of it as like a. Um, never said in the past. Really talks. Think of it I as the. Uh, so. The okay. borrow game. You yeah. get your back. It's a thing. I club don't don't ask. Garban. You, Gar -ban. you oh, yeah. find somebody on the side that wants to oh, take your oh, stuff. Good thing. You walk him out. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Good thing. Thank you very much. You have a wonderful day. You as well. Do you mind if I share this table with you? Of course. Fucking. Of course not. Be my pleasure. Well, you never know what you can find on the road. Sometimes, for the most part, whatever you can is whatever you got. For the most part, it's probably going to be old, shitty, rusted out, dull. How are you today? <laughs> I'm good. Good. What about you? <laughs> been a little busy. I had a late night last night, but so far today has been good. It is good. I had saw you walking around earlier and I got a little uh, preemptive and went over to the uh, the bathhouse in hopes maybe we wanted to talk. <laughs> Do you have something you want to tell me? <laughs> maybe. There's a few things I'd like to tell you. We can take a walk if you would like. I'm kind of off duty right Let now. Let me finish my water. I won't rush you. Oh. I'd love to give you this information. <laughs> After the fight ends <laughs> and they close the doors before they clean up the blood, uh, they jump in and make a promise so I can buy corn. So tell me about yourself. About me? Sure. What do you want to know? Surprise me. Mm. Most people think that I, uh, that I dance just because they tell me to. I do it because I enjoy it. Uh, dance or it hard. I want to be free. From what? And dancing is what gives me that freedom. I had a very controlling family growing up. Your mother, Rosemary? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I have to ask, what is your father's name? Very uh, mundane. <laughs> as I should say, as I had said before, his, his names for my brothers were, you know, Mark hmm. and Anthony and John and all that fun, very boring names. His name was Gio. Say Gio? Hmm. Like a rock? He, he went by a nickname. <laughs> no. G-I-O. Ah. Like Giovanni. Giovanni. I take it you are born in, in Gradia as well? Such is the free spirit. Yes, I was born in Gradia. Mm -hmm. So I wasn't born in Notis. Notis has been my home, not my family's. Ever been to the capital? <laughs> He's large. I've met a few people from around, though. So. Oh, yeah? Is it? Very large, lots of water, a lot of people. Much bigger than these. A lot of opportunities, mm. good and bad. I see. Well, let me put my cap up. You and I can have that walk and I can tell you a few things. Strong wood. <laughs> well, After you. We uh, shall. Good construction. Uh, there's probably the reason it hasn't broken yet. Strong uh, dwarven craftsmanship. Gonna. Never mind. Never mind. Stupid thought. I say I, you work fast. I thought we would be speaking in a couple of days, mm -hmm. but why well, you work fast? <laughs> Let's just say I had a little bit of a guest last night. Oh, lucky and I got you. some information for you. Should I feel jealous? I don't know, should you? Hmm? No, should I? <laughs> oh, you grip me away. I don't know if you should. You're growing on me. Don't worry. That's good to hear. Hope I'm growing on you as well. Oh, you definitely are. You and I get a very special job to do today. Oh, really? Hmm. You'd be coming with me upstairs. Sorry to interrupt you too. No, it's alright. I was just giving Peter a bath. <laughs> Up the stairs we go. I will check to make sure none of the girls are using this room right now. I didn't see anyone in here before, but then again, we have, but not for a little bit. Let me see.
We have the room to ourselves. So. You changed the layout since I was here last. Maybe a little bit. Hmm. Things feel a little bigger. A little. <laughs> Maybe I'm getting more comfortable we here. We move some things a little further out. <laughs> so. My information for you is that that guest of mine that I had the other day is coming back. Going to be coming through town. And we're going to be in this room. Tonight, I thought you would like to know. Kovas? Mm -hmm. I'll keep the door unlocked for you if you would like to... That would be very handy, actually. <laughs> well, I would like to assist you. You can uh, bring him in here, yes? Mm hmm This room is only for nobles, after all. He mm. likes the bath quite a bit. Sure, I can hide behind the uh, screen here. That could work. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's do that. Do you know uh, <laughs> what time later tonight or sunset or... Let me think about this for you. I think he's supposed to be coming around... Hmm. Should be tonight, around the evening hours. Okay. Just keep your eye out. I hear he's going to go to the tavern first. That's actually why I was waiting People there. People really enjoy him. Mm. <laughs> well. Since we're here. <laughs> hmm? Don't worry, I'm not taking off your mask. I know your charm will hypnotize me and make me fall madly in love with you. Mm-hmm. No, 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 neither <laughs> of us want that. So, uh, anything mm -hmm. else, or is that it for today? Well, for now. Mm. That is all I have for you, for now. Again, I will leave the door open for you if you'd like to have a listen. I most likely will. You are, uh, still being treated okay here? I yes, I am uh, being treated quite well, actually. <laughs> no, no, you don't have to. Good. If uh, if you do, though, I know you promise. And I will tell you if anybody mistreats me. Good. I will uh, make sure they think hard about what they've done, if that is the case. <laughs> I thank you very much. <laughs> well, I look forward to seeing you work tonight, then. I'm sure it will I be an interesting experience. It's night, then. Maybe afterwards we can... talk a little bit more? We'll see how well you do. See what information we get. <laughs> Let's see. Well. Will I leave first, or do you want to leave? I'll leave first. You are a pleasure to work with, Miss Basil. In many ways. <laughs> pleasure. Oh, I guess. But I'm concerned that the puppy is floating in midair. Oh? This dog is fine. Okay. Dad is brain uh, bard was going a little crazy right there. <laughs> how how long have you been in this town? Uh, let's see. Probably like around. 
Have a good day. Alright. So, you have anything planned for today, Mr. Sides? appreciate that. Of and course. the help that would definitely be appreciated. Mm. Master, what do you do for the rest well, of the day? when you do... Well, when you do finally feel the courage to finally show what you have composed, if you need to ask. Uh, I appreciate that. Thank you. Of course. Do not let me take any more of rest well. of your day. I think I might try and speak to that one individual that Elen was talking about. The leather worker? Uh, see if I can find her sometime uh, today. Is that her name? Yes. Well, at least that saves, an <laughs> that saves any awkward introductions. But yeah, I figured Elen <laughs> was telling me to try and acquaint myself with some people and they suggested the leather worker i guess to get me new boots i don't know i don't see what's wrong with my current ones but <laughs> well she is uh, she is uh she's very friendly and uh, a very eccentric but very uh very hard worker <laughs> it's hard to miss her she's a uh, she's a bit of, she's a bit of a she tends to light up in a crowd, you could say. <laughs> mm, I think I catch your meaning. Well, Isabella... You might actually relate with pleasure. her. She's a bit of an antenna herself. Oh, boy. I guess, um, you know, I guess this might be well worth, uh, well worth meeting. <laughs> I do believe she did well, and she's got confidence to spare. You enjoy it. You'll probably enjoy meeting her. Oh, then maybe I really need to get my ways along, and then that's the case. A pleasure again, Isabella. Hopefully, we meet again soon. <laughs> that's my as well. Take care.
you know, know, couples argue in the daylight all the know. time. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's just a couple's argument. Know. What's the problem? It's just I a couple's don't argument. Want to know. I don't Why don't want you to want know. to know? You're so shy about this. You're worse than I am about this. You know that? Hello. Yeah, it's a mix of, uh, he knows what he has to do and his, uh, minor detriment. It's a hard thing to balance for him. Yeah, I was hoping that was sunset, but no. I was going to start walking towards the tavern, but... <sighs> Let me sit properly here. You're gonna do what with a what? <laughs>
<clears throat> yeah, Basil's important. Unfortunately. <laughs> she's in a good position and she's... Kyla's got a... an angle on her <clears throat> that he can work, but... <laughs> yeah. A lot of important things that are said <clears throat> to brothel workers. I don't mind a bit of Savita skullduggery. It's fun. It's just weighing on Kyla, that's all. These fucking seagulls. What was the game of the tournament? Different person. That's why I checked the uh the name. At least I'm pretty sure it's a different person. I know Zeke is meant to be playing the, the gambler, so I, I don't know what's up with that. weapon and the short sword aside from the dagger and the throwing knives I don't know the short sword kind of fits doesn't it a fucking great sword yeah Something. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I don't think it was the gambler, though. It's actually a pretty chill spot. I don't mind sitting here for a bit. Can't do anything at the forge. <laughs> we don't have any iron or anything, so...
It should be evening time soon. Chill vibes, yeah. Day and night. The lonely stoner seems to freeze. Right in it. I could browse the music and remind myself of what they sound like. Now that it's not lagging so much. <coughs> this one's a good one. God, I'm tired. Plus, Kyla's tired too. He wouldn't be up and about all day. Needs to rest. I love the Ace Combat 7 soundtracks. Now I'm crunchy again. Even if I could, it'd all be gray. Except your picture on my wall. <laughs> it reminds me that it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dear Arn, I wrote you, but you still ain't calling. I left my home address and three copper at the bottom. There probably was a problem with a raven or something. You must not have got him. See a dragon.
My address is too sloppy when I jot it. <laughs> but anyway, what's up? How's your fish wife? <laughs> I don't want to be a father, neither. My father used to... <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> I should probably do something, huh? That's it. I can't fucking take it anymore. All of these split orders have pushed me to the fucking edge, chat. My ale's gone cold, I'm wondering why. Heard nothing of dread knives at all. If they saw me, they'd want to kill me. But da 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 da. Probably was a problem with the Gravens or something. Something something addressed too sloppy when I jot it. Something something ink is smeary. <laughs> Sit down by the flowers outside near the near the infirmary. All right. I can only breathe for <laughs> once, considering of what's been happening. Oh, 
I can do is try, mate. Oh, no. You owe me 60 Holy. copper. What? I, Hello? Oh, yeah. Yes, yes, I know. The wife's already been giving me enough shit for that. I am mm -hmm. I got the next 20 60. for you. What did he do? Oh, I can what only pay do? in 20. Do you know? Don't even have enough wine copper. last night. <laughs> As a result of least coming right. along well. Oh, yeah, the belt is like done, but Thank listen. You. Looking around. Fuck. I need to just relax. Everything seems so hot. It's so hot today. You really wish you had like more summer esque uniforms, far lighter in quality. Look how puffy that shirt is. Wouldn't it be nice to have such a puffy shirt? God, this puffy shirt is amazing. Can I ask you a question? I can bet. I was gonna ask you a question, oh. so uh, perhaps after you. After you, you're the one you you asked first. Uh, looking for a, a dwarf, uh, Aldo looks uh, bald, has a beard, woodworker. Yeah, I know Aldo. Uh... <sighs> I could not tell you. I've unfortunately been posted here for God knows how long, uh, because for some reason I am the only guard around. <laughs> That's, uh, that sucks. You're doing a good work there, yeah, honestly. You can imagine. It needs I, to be I done. I have my question for you. Okay. Yep. Have you seen a man? Yes. With blonde hair, oh. a white shirt, brown eyes. Uh, not fancy. He's not the old dressed up fancy. Blonde hair. Brown eyes, white shirt. A bit chubby, uh, full of himself. He's usually seen at the tavern, drinking and gambling. Uh, no. Okay, well, just for your information, he was holding the tavern keep at knife point, uh, trying to, uh, what I guess is extort him for money. Holy saying shit. that he owes him something, so, yeah. It's criminals around here. I... Should I, should I not feel safe? I don't even know at this point. I, I don't even feel safe. I'm quite literally the only guard. They kill me and then they're free, free reign. Understood. Fuck this place. <laughs> I've lived here all my life. Look, I'm sure it gets better over time. I'm so sorry you have to do this. God, I hope so. Take your lumps, I guess. I, I don't know. I, <laughs> switch into someone else. All right. Please I'm gonna go put on my full plate, then I'll get stabbed in the back. Stabbed from behind? <laughs> Soma. Have you seen hmm. Aldo oh, recently? Yes. Aldo? Mmm... Uh, not too sure about that. No worries. Figured I'd ask. No problem. I understand. How's it going, stranger? Hand over your shoes. So you're gonna have to untie the laces. Sensually. You have a lot of sensually? Sensually. Mm, no. Have you seen Aldo recently? Then you. You ain't getting my shoes. Ah, oh, yeah, I did see him. He was uh, right here and then he left somewhere. I'm assuming he's at a shop. I don't know where his shop is. There's gonna be somewhere. Uh, Good luck. Please stand aside. Someone injured. What the fuck? Hilariously, she seems to have the wood on her.
They were Spartan enough to tire at wolves and hunt them down. A pack of three. We did pass somewhere uh, by the field. Yesterday, I think they said that they might have passed. Howdy. You're the apprentice, right? Yeah. The, uh, blacksmith. Do either of you know if anyone else was injured out there? Have you said that? Um, hmm? Go ahead. Just want to say that's uh. Seem like a good lad. Doing a lot of hard work. Yeah, I'm trying. It's been busy. We work hard though. Not... Have you seen Aldo around, short little dwarf? Mm. I just checked his uh, stall, but he's not there right now, no. Where is his stall? Unfortunately, oh. I... Um, did you walk down that way to the left? Someone was looking for you. You have four small miscellaneous iron coming your way. Oh, handy. Alright. Hey, what was the deal with the. Uh, like yes. That I have no idea about. Hopefully, I'm able to get some more information about it later on, but. Well, it is this. Yes. Injured, and she is not doing well upstairs. Mm. That's not to get near If you your, catch my meaning. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> get injured, I suppose. She seems to have it under control at the moment. Good. Alright, I'm gonna try and find Aldo. Yes. Yes. I ask you a favor and ask her in my stead. I am. You should be here down over here. Hmm. I don't think he's there, though. Matt, you at least know where the stall is, right? Uh, is it this one down here? This looks like a woodworker's thing. Yes. Okay, good to know. Alright, I'll have a gander, I suppose. Oh. If I see him, um, who should I let him know who's looking for him? Uh, Shariq. The, uh, just, yeah, Shariq. the apprentice. Yeah, he'll hunt me down, I'm sure. Oof. Take care now. Worse because it makes me feel like there's a thing I can do to help them, you know, kind of my little soft spot. Well, something's afoot every night, you shouldn't cause panic, so I stopped telling people. But why would they take why would they take special notice and just to tell me? There he is. Be careful. Come on over, look yourself. There's who? Me? You, yes, you. 
¿Qué día? How can I help you? Now you know Miss Lottie's not going to give you any free scraps. Now I don't think. Oh right, did you still want those uh, wooden swords? Yes, there? and I have the wood here. Ooh. Yeah. Well, anything you can ask for. All right. So, how much would it cost to get two wooden swords? I have four bits of wood for you. Uh, let's see, with the wood here... Uh, for two swords... Uh, I could probably do two. How about 30 copper? That sounds great to me. Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you. Of course. I'll get to work on that right now, actually. Thank you, Aldo. Yeah, just leave them by the forge when you're done if mm -hmm. I'm not around. All right, I'll be sure to. Uh, just a fair warning. There's no in-map representation for a wooden sword yet. There might be soon. I can, I'll leave a wooden ladle in its place. <laughs> I look forward to it. Hoggers. You don't look like an Ellen. Nope. Wait, you're a kid. What? Hmm. Just the man I was looking for. You put in an order with a uh, Vezrin earlier. Or I did. You were your uh, master. I don't know what, what do you call it. He's the apprentice, right? So yeah, your apprentice uh, pupil. Yeah. They all work. Sure. Well, no, no. Well, his well, I'm talking about like you know his teacher. Master's fine. Um, Alen, there was an angry blue person looking for potions. I think she just went up to the shop, way, shop so. right now. All right, let's yeah. go see. Anyway, uh, I have four iron miscellaneous. Yeah. I'll be back. If you two find a second, go to the clinic. I believe you already paid for it. Sith we did. Stabbed. Or at least your master has. A, was it Tazim? Are you Tazim or is the other one Tazim? He's Tazim. Sure, right? I'm Sharik. Right, yes. All right. Anyway, and your day. name is Markle. Markle. We're matching. We have the whole ring on yeah. the. Well, look at that. Good style. Appreciate it, Markle. No problem. Huh? Well, you're looking for the potion maker. Looking for something in particular, and not out in public. Do you mind? You have somewhere. Yeah, we can come inside my shop. Good. What can I do for you? I don't know. For some reason, I feel like we're about to start chanting. I can't no, not, stop not bouncing. This feeling. 
<laughs> no. No. I don't suppose that uh, Raven told you any good spots to find seashells or coral. Try the beach. Or... Besides the beach. Hello. What are you? <laughs> the longest the one. Should he know? Answer this man a question. Uh, okay. He dives. Oh, do you know where to find any good seashells or coral? Oh, I, I could try to see if I can find anything. Um, you, you want me to try? Well, I was more so sort of asking about locations because I can, I can kind of see. I mean, I've seen, I, I've seen some coral it, it, under the docks. There's not too much. Uh, there's occasionally just a few bones, a couple of dead fish. Sometimes there's a bit of wood that floats by. Uh, but over over that direction, over there, uh, there there's more like listen, ocean life. Uh, that, so that's a house. Fish, coral. And then, well, like, if you're to flow the beach, they fall the beach, no, like, no, under the docks over there. Oh. Uh, yeah. Wait, wait, no. <laughs> but, yeah, if you go uh, over there into the water and then go right, you can get something over there. And then if you go left, it's kind of towards the lighthouse. And uh, th there's more rocks over there. But I think right is where you can find the coral and clams and shells. I see. I, I mean, if you go straight out, well, I've seen a lot of fish out there, so I don't go too far out. And I also, it looks like it's kind of a fall, so I'm not sure. If, I, I don't go out there. I, I understand. I won't exactly walk off the edge of the ocean. Mm. You shut up. I have walked along the lake. I have walked along a lake bed before. Walking along a shoreline should be fine, just to find one seashell. I kind of want to see this. You. I'm quite curious as well. Yeah. I. <laughs> Dredge. Did you scare him and say nightmare, 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 and then hit your your anchor on the ground? <laughs> that was not yesterday. Yesterday, I get a barrel, found it in the road, stuff him in it, and shake him. <laughs> Someone even paid me five copper. Well, paid knows us who paid me. That's amazing. <laughs> Glad you're having fun. I also kicked him into the ocean. <laughs> Why are you hiding, Severick? I don't understand. He's very scary. What was scary? There's nothing Maybe scary about it. I should grab me. you and throw you into the ocean. Uh, I, I tried to be friends with him, but then he put me in a barrel. <laughs> Let me see something funny. Oh. Hey, Shadig. Yeah. No, 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 no! I'm going to be sick. Please, put him down. Okay, put him down before he makes 
shake him too much and you're not going to be able to do it again. Are you alright? <laughs> oh dear. Do, do you need to, um, spell your Is he going to throw up? <laughs> Come on, throw up. It'll be funny. Bugs are back. <laughs> there, there. Okay. No, I got it. It was in my mouth. No, and don't. I swallowed it. Don't. Don't just. Uh, That's a terrible uh, idea. You just need to let it out. No. If you keep it all down, then it's. <laughs> Cost 20 copper for a fucking meal tag. I'm not buying another one. Ugh, one of the bones of my ass. He's gonna get to rubbing your back. You are violent. It's okay. Okay. But I just want to say this. Yeah. Did you have fun? If I say yes, will you never do it again? <laughs> if I say yes, will you not expect the next time? I will never expect the next okay. time. That's so... <sighs> Ugh. Exactly. It was, it was probably a one-time thing. I feel like I have a anyway. concussion. Look, Dredge, I know you had a lot of fun. You know, all of that was a distraction for you, and you're still here. I'm frozen with fear. Why? I can fix that. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't break the table. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> Wait a minute. Hold on. Uh, hold on. My God, that's terrifying. <laughs> For a second, I thought that he was too bulky to reach that far in. <laughs> I am sorely mistaken. What? What? Please don't hurt him. You know what is always good for fear? Oh dear. Should we stop him? Do you think you could? Kane, what the hell is going on? No, I don't think no, I could. Just let it happen. Just let it happen. Fuck, what's his name again? I, I think oh, it sells another character? Why am I blanking on. on it? Hold on. Oh, uh, Shariq, um, if you're okay with it, I'll have that done in the morning. Yeah, sure. Take your time. Alright, let's just make it sure. I'm gonna watch a hobbit get skimmed off the ocean. He knows how to swim, he's fine. I know that one swims. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 Petey. Oh, the shit. Oh, fuck, he really is talking about the water. Well, he's a diver, he knows how to swim. Well, that's like one less loose end. Papa, yes. Before he hit the, hit the like a <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't tell from this distance. My eyesight's not as good Shriek. as it used to be. Shriek, yes. Mm. I believe my pupil Raven has an extension in hand. And invite you to the hunter's camp. Yeah, I've been busy. I've been meaning to show up, but things are, you know. Well, whenever you are free. Of course. I'm more than welcome to escort you to the to the camp. Lorelai, right? Yes. Yes. Pleasure to meet okay. you. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna skedaddle before he comes back. Oh yes, <laughs> I believe that would be wise. What's going on? Um... So, I called Dredge out on, uh, nearly hitting Severick with his anchor and screaming nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. So, Severick hid under our table, and Dredge picked him up and carried him down here and threw him into the ocean. No, he's hunting him. It's like a shock. You okay? Yes, it's just really hot and passing time. I have work later tonight. Uh, me too. Shit gives me a headache. Yep. Really? Where are you going? Uh, still in town. Not going out anywhere. Just... Looking at a few things, you know. You should be back when it's night time. If you need any help. Mm -hmm. Are you going on another caravan mission? Seems like it. I'm not really sure what it entails, but. 
I'll tell you after the job's done. Sure. Did, uh... Did Vezrin speak to you? Uh, a little bit. What about... Uh, oh, lad, did, uh, Marco drop... Marco was looking for you. They were dropping off some iron. And he they did. had some iron for you. He did. Thank you, Eli. Alright. Yeah, no problem. I guess that. The iron? Yeah, we got some small miscellaneous iron. Fucking bankrupted us, though. Holy shit. <laughs> we had eight silver in the fucking forge, and now we have less than two. I see. Right, we need That's to get unfortunate. I'm sure you'll make it back. Yeah. Done myself in as well, renting a crossbow. Oh, yeah. I got the dog swimming. <laughs> hey, I got a question for you two. You want to see the most deadly weapon you have ever seen? I'm carrying it. You're looking at it. <laughs> no, I, I, I have it over at my house. Oh, I'll yeah? I'll go get it if you want to see it. So sure. It'll be, a, it'll be a real treat. Sure. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back. You know, I nearly said you're looking you at it too, actually. That would have been funny. <laughs> you should have fucking... <laughs> you should have done that. Fuck. It's so... Fuck. <laughs> dogs are wet. You know, I was at the bathhouse earlier, right? The they were washing it. I don't know why I have to associate these fucking creatures. <laughs> they should have a drow bath. <laughs> no, they were. He's really Just quiet. The fuck out of me. Yeah. I know. <laughs> You'd be surprised how quiet Tan can be. Yeah, I'm quiet when I don't want to be. <laughs> That's why sometimes he's as sneaky as you at times, lad. That's a bit of a overstatement. That is a stretch. Hmm. Okay. That is okay. So much Maybe a, not as good. That is so much of a stretch, I could pull you off in the bottom of that river. Or trench. Please don't pick me up oh, again. Oh, shit. All right. Here's... Is that your wooden sword? Here's the wooden sword that yeah. made for me. <laughs> he said the same thing to me. <laughs> we, don't, we don't have wooden swords yet, so he's using a ladle as a prop. <laughs> to be honest, it confused one of the guards. He, he thought I had a real sword out and I was threatening people with it. No. <laughs> I challenge you to a duel. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. If you say so, middle man. <laughs> Standing right, here, right, clean, clean, clean. I Good realize. Rolling. <laughs> Cramp. <laughs> <laughs> hey Leo, <laughs> wait, where's my spoon? Kang, as you try to use your finger to fight off against the spoon, <laughs> it's not a spoon. <laughs> he's he's doing quite well. You're actually getting pushed back. However. Your